What is going on everyone? It's Quinton here. Welcome to Young and Investing and also thank you for 40,000 subscribers. I just hit over 40,000 subscribers. I'm really, really thankful for that. And because of that, we're going to do a giveaway. So what we are going to do is we're going to give away 0 0.05, which is currently worth around $60. We're going to give this away every video from now on, um, probably for a few videos. I don't know how many yet. Uh, we will see. So uh, what you need to do is you need to put your Ethereum address in the comment section down below. You need to be a subscriber of the channel and also turn on the notifications. That's the little bell icon next to the subscribe button. So that's all you need to do for the giveaway. And you can do this for several videos. I will post the next few days. So also I'm going to do a separate giveaway on my Twitter account. So be sure to also follow me on Twitter because you can also win there. 0.05 ether also worth around $60 obviously so follow me there as well the uh, link to my twitter account is also in the description down below in this video we're going to do a top 5 cryptocurrency video that are currently worth under uh, one dollar and I do this separate video actually because I always talk about the same cryptocurrencies which you probably already know I like such as Substratum, uh, Dragon Chain, etc. So I talk about these ones such a lot. But I also want to give you guys another list. So not only always the same things. So that's why I'm doing also a top 5 picks that are currently worth under $1. So let's get started with the first one in my list, which is Cardano. And by the way, this is in a totally random order. So it's not that the first one is, on, is my five, fifth pick or something. No, just I like them all, all five I'm going to talk about. So the first one is Cardano, as I said. And Cardano, I like this so much because this is probably going to be the best platform out there. I say going to be because it's currently not released yet. Cardano is a platform on which ICOs can be built, with which actually also companies can work with. Um, so it's a platform such as Ethereum, such as NIM, such as NEO, uh, EOS, you can name them like the typical uh, platforms, but Cardano is done by engineers, by PhDs, and also the CEO, Charles Hoskinson, it was the ex-CEO of Ethereum. So this is a very important person in the cryptocurrency industry. Cardano is the most promising platform of them all. It's super scalable, it's super flexible, it's super fast, uh, a lot of transactions per second. And it's going to be very easy to build with. So that's why Cardano is my first pick. I really like this one. Currently already worth over 20 billion, 22 billion um, US dollar. Ranked fifth on CoinMarketCap.com as we can see right here. And the product is not yet out. So that's just crazy. Then the second pick is BitShares. And BitShares, I already talked about BitShares once. Uh, but what I like so much about BitShares is they are doing several things. And one of the things which actually is, in my opinion, the most important thing is they have a decentralized exchange. And this exchange is super great and still needs to be discovered. BitShares is ranked currently 29th on market cap with a market cap of almost $2 billion. Um, but what I was saying about this exchange is that uh, this decentralized exchange is super great. Um, if you look, for example, to Bit Bittrex, to uh, Binance, to other exchanges, the typical exchanges, they can only handle a certain amount of people before um, actually over volume, before the whole thing is starting to go slowly, um, crashing, etc. And BitShares claims to uh, be able to handle up to 10 times the volume of the classic exchanges because this decentralized and uses the power of all the different nodes in the decentralized network, obviously. So that is super great. I think it still needs to be discovered. And also what I like so much about decentralized exchanges such as BitShares, which is probably the best one out there, um, BitShares, this is actually because 
um, governments are going to be regulating the exchanges or at least in some countries they are doing this. As you know, in China, for example, they are all shut down. So uh, decentralized exchanges can, can, can actually fix this. For example, if we would have a decentralized exchange in China, government wouldn't be able to do anything. So it is actually totally government proof. It is totally um, protected against regulations. So that is super cool about decentralized exchanges. Then the third one I want to talk about is Quantstamp. And Quantstamp, I think I didn't talk about it once on my channel and I should actually, because this is a super great protocol. This is a protocol built on the Ethereum network to secure all the smart contracts. And I will just show you the website. Um, and it's actually coming up very quickly lately. Um, it is only on the market for a few months. So it had its ICO and then it came to the market. And as we see right here, it went up from 10 cents just over, um, not even a month ago, let's say a few weeks ago, it was still around 10 cents right here. And right now it is hanging around 70 cents. So Quantstamp is going up very quickly. It is already ranked 91st on CoinMarketCap. So Quantstamp, what it is, it is, like I said, a protocol for securing smart contracts. And it's actually coming up very quickly, as I just showed you on the charts. But especially also the team is super great. They have a super cool team behind the project. Look at this. Um, you should check it out. I don't have the time to go into detail about this. But Quantstep is very, very promising. And I think we will see, still see it go up in value the next few months. So I like this one as well. And currently around 70 cents. Then we have my fourth pick that is Eatland. And Eatland is actually a landing platform, um, a decentralized landing platform also built on the Ethereum blockchain. But what is very cool about this is that it only has a market cap right now of 340 million US dollars. And if we have a look to its biggest competitor, which is SALT, it's actually the same idea. It is basically like we said, landing. This, so you can actually just fully decentralized peer-to-peer -peer landing on the Ethereum blockchain. As I said, SALT is their major competitor. And SALT almost has uh, actually double, has more than double of the market cap of Eatland. Eatland 340 million, SALT 800 million. And the thing is, Eatland already has a working product and already has everything in place to work as a landing platform. And then you have SALT and SALT is more than double the value of, of Eatland and SALT doesn't have a working product yet. It is still being tested, etc. So basically what I think will happen is that Eatland will at least come very close to SALT because they are actually doing exactly the same thing and still Eatland has a working product and still only half, word half of what SALT is worth. So that is why I like Eatland also so much. Let's go back to... Um, page right here so yeah that's why i actually like eatland it is only ranked 107th uh, on coin market cap so yeah it is all also not around for a long time already just a month and a half not even um when it came to the markets but yeah eatland i like this one as well then the fifth one and last one i want to talk about then we're going to finish this is sun and sun is actually a supercomputer also built on the Ethereum blockchain. So basically they are taking computer power from different computers and putting this into a supercomputer. And this can actually do several things. So let's go have a look at the website very quickly. Uh, Sun, by the way, is also coming out of ICO uh, not too long ago, only half a year ago. So it's not around for a long time. Um, but then suddenly it actually came out of nowhere. Uh, because it was not really worth a lot and then it came out of nowhere and it shot up to right now being worth 60 cents um, also around a month ago and it is ranked 138 on core market cap with a market cap total of more than 200 million US dollars in the meantime um, they had a successful ICO by the way they had a very good ICO uh, but then it really disappeared a little bit off the radar but this is actually a very great idea and they are proving that this is working because their first their testnet is out so their first product the mvp 
is basically go coming out very soon and it's right now being tested so they are ahead of schedule by the way because it was only planned for the end of december i guess and they released it um i think two weeks ago so that's super cool um you should check out more about psalm it is just a universal fog supercomputer powered by ethereum blockchain and it can basically do everything like you can see here the use cases it can do side hosting applications machine learning video streaming game servers scientific research and video rendering so basically the supercomputer built with psalm um it can do basically everything so i really like this project as well and i think there is some good potential for sun as well so guys that is it that's my top five cryptocurrencies which are currently worth under one dollar thank you guys so much for watching if you like the video hit the subs the like button the subscribe button obviously also if you like it but i meant to say the like button the thumbs up so if you like it do it guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to put your ethereum address in the comments down below to win some ethereum thank you guys cheers